Hello there, Golf Freak here, and welcome back to Let's Play of Civ 5 as Portugal, where we last left off. Rome was at declared war against me, and I have a sneaking suspicion Germany's next. Um, I'm okay with this because I have my guys down here. So I'll be able to probably. I, what I probably should do is get in position and sweep in from this way because this will be the easiest ones. So let's let's do this actually really quickly where I'm going to move. The majority of my troops for the attack over here. Get some upgrades and get all my defensive troops more or less over here, and you're gonna come over here as well. Anyway, though, I think we're going to be okay. I'm going to have some units pretty quickly. I am very suspicious of this, though. Oh my gosh, that's a lot of troops. Yeesh. I wasn't expecting that many troops. So I actually may lose this city. Which will suck, because I'll lose all my coal. Um, do I continue? You know what? The cannon is the one that's going to do the most damage to me. So I think I'm going to hit the cannon again. And we'll take it out next time with the city. And let's weaken more troops. We're going to get the walls next turn. Yeesh. Yeesh, yeesh, yeesh. Kind of got caught with my pants down a little bit, I think. No, I can't spend any more money. I seriously wasn't expecting them to do that so quickly. But, you know, with the walls up, as long as I don't lose it this turn, with the walls up, taking out this cannon, and then eventually getting all my other troops down here, I think I'll be... Why aren't you moving? I thought I told you to come down here. Well, that sucks. Seriously? Build a farm in the middle of the desert. Why not? Hopefully he'll either retreat the cannon or something. But I definitely need like a castle and everything in here and... Okay, so he's gonna fire. Well, that was odd. See how low it got for a second there? He was hiding a lot. I found your proposal for the Congress very troubling. <laughs> Walls have been built. Finish off the cannon so we can't do as much damage. Finish off... Well, no. I don't want to finish off any of these units because they're super weak. So I'd rather have them actually attack the city and leave these full-strength units behind. 
So kill off this and then just attack whatever else is nearby. Six rooms for a castle, how about I purchase it? Um, 970. I don't think I can make any more money. He'll die. You know what? I'll, I can yeah, trade these extra don't. resources, but what would you like for 10 horses? Okay, I don't care about horses. Just say 200 gold. Wow. Okay, yes. Um, it's horses I don't care about that much. Actually, you know what? You still have money. Why don't we see if he wants more? He'll die. Let's go. Um, three. Fifty? He'll fiend out here. Okay, he doesn't want any more horses. I see. Maybe someone else will. Horses for eighty. Okay. Come on, who wants? I am Bano. You? Actually, that is a great deal. I'm just going to take that straight up. <laughs> uh, you know, Gandhi, you're not very strong. How about oil? No. Okay. Okay. Sweet. Kill you. Purchase. Oh, 9 4. I'm still short. Oh, I can sell more oil, I guess. I have a lot of it. Oh, we can't trade gold with you. I don't want to give you any. Or Napoleon. I don't want as much gold per turn. What is your. Yeah. And then with the castle, that's going to be ridiculously hard to take. Especially with the majority being melee units. Um, see, I don't want to kill any of these units because I want the weak ones to block the other ones. And he's planning on attack, I can tell. So I'd need even more troops. Build the arsenal naturally. Yeah. Stoneworks. Still not have any aluminum. Here we go. I 
Let's see. I should probably also annex Philadelphia. So let's see. Our 7859 annex. 759. Okay, so it's just having a city up makes the cost go up by 5%. That's just good to know. Courthouse, monument, university, windmill. Forget about this. Germany has adopted the order ideology. Well, that's not that surprising. I probably will go down. F well, I don't know if it'll let me take a look at what I got first. That'd be preferable. Okay, so they both raised those tiles. Hey, I like it. I like this. So I'll just hit these guys again. And then, well, yeah. I don't have as much to worry about anymore. Spy has been recruited. Go alert. Um, and you're just kind of going to be around here. Okay, you are going to hit this guy. Okay, I'd like to two hit this. Oh, look at that. Yeah, that's much nicer. have you up here okay um see let's finish the porcelain tower now i think i'm okay and then move you to valletta i think there was an enemy spy in there See, I can adopt now. Now, now is it the same as my when you build your third factory or enter the modern era? Wait, which era am I in? I'm in the modern era. Um, does that mean I'm going to get it? Okay, you know what? I just realized too is I have a bunch of wonders to build, so it's better if I go straight for the railroad and then. Go for replaceable parts. And then... Plastics. What am I doing in science? I'm in first place, which is awesome because I, I uh, ignored some before. Uh, new. This is suspicious. I think after I get these units out, we'll just go... We'll have these three cities as military producers. So I don't think Rome's capable of actually taking the city anymore. The added defenses, the increased healing, the fact that he doesn't really have much he can do. Yeah, see, I figured he was going to do that. But that's okay.
We'll just keep wounded people near the city, and as soon as everyone's wounded, then we start taking them out one by one. A brave new world. The time to cho choose a path for your people and your empire. Each ideology, freedom, order, and autocracy contains a unique set of increasingly powerful tenets that will form the foundation of your ideology and influence your diplomatic relationships for years to come. Thank you, good ma'am. Okay, um, I need to see the details. Autocracy. Level 1. Wood motor units. 25% 25% more damage than normal. Yeah, that's mainly if you have, like, tons of military. Freedom! I want great people. Let's see, rate of great people are increased by 25%. Culture from reach great work, but tourism is unchanged. That sounds pretty good. Specialists because only half the normal amount of food. That is really good. We want a lot of specialists. Um, usually on my other playthroughs, when, this, when these are policies, I go down order, like, every single time. But, uh... Plus four the appropriate yield. You know what? I really like. I really like freedom at first glance. Okay, so this also gives plus 25%. Um. Wow, new seeds with. Additional. Wow, that's really good too. You know what? I think I want to go down order. Do I have less happiness? Free courthouse on city capture. Wow, that would be really nice. So it's between freedom. Plus one culture from Great Works is going to be quite nice. Ooh, that's actually really good. You know, the extra production, because we still get the plus 25% great people, which is what I mainly wanted. And we get some better, yeah. We get, there are some better stuff in here. I think we're going to down order. Yeah, I kind of agree. We want the farm here. work oh and we get a free social policy or tenant so it's like you need you need a level one for every level two and we need two level ones for every level two I see that's pretty good and you can just get two more after that so we get a free tenant because we were one of the first two to actually do it. Um, yeah, let's get this because we want the great people. I'm encouraging people to be specialists. Uh, we're going to need happiness from other stuff as well, but... Uh, like half the, I think it was half the happiness from specialists. That was really nice, but I, I think the production's a little bit better. Because I am, I've made basically enemies of a lot of people, so... But yeah, we have this under control. So my capital doesn't have to worry about them anymore. In fact, 
I'm actually going to... I think Germany is going to attack me, so I am actually going to hold you back over here. To kind of stem whatever decides to come over here until I get more troops over there. <sighs> but yeah, they really made f the d choice between freedom and order a lot more difficult to make. No. Not yet. Unless he pulls a retreat. And the reason... Or does that. I want to kill off some of his units. And I'm going to do that right now. Get a little bit more XP, but otherwise I am willing to take peace. So I think we'll kill off his units and ask him. Oh, Brussels, really? But yes, yeah, I have lots of large cities, so I should be having plenty of specialists. 20 unhappiness from specialists? I'd say so. Okay. Who can you kill? You and you. So you can kill you, you can kill you, and you can kill you. Thank you. Okay, now, Rome, I am ready to make peace. All the way. Okay, he's going to offer me less gold, but I'm okay with it. Consent you. Let's do this because he can't attack me anyway, and send you down here. And I'm going to boost this defense because these two cities are going to be prime targets for enemy attack. Let's see, Broadway, plus two culture and more great slots. Now, we want that in my capital. And I think I have a significant enough lead. I don't really have to worry about uh, much there. And I'm getting enough coal. We have enough happiness. Let's get this. I'll build a settler pretty quickly and get him out here. We have enough happiness for that. Um, I will need a bit of a navy there, though. Military Academy. So we have, yeah, we have 75% bonus on all these guys. We'll have 100% bonus if uh, I can take Berlin's capital, which I'll probably do as soon as possible. But so, yes, yeah, so let's see. Swap great works. Still all medieval. Yeah, I think it's safe to say that Germany wants to invade me. So we are going to get a wall. Sure. We're going to get a wall of uh, Gatling guns. Keep that one in here. We've got what? Only the one more coming? Yeah, actually, because I have high tourism. But yeah, I think it's safe to say um, Germany's planning an invasion. Okay, that got built in the faraway land. That would have been nice, but um, I'm busy with other stuff. See, I am hosting the World Congress this year, right? Okay, I do not want this.
I will nay the heck out of this. Okay, you can heal up. Yeah, you know what? I want Lisbon to grow up, so... Grow up! Nice and big. Because having all the growth there means we get lots of people there. I have all the bonuses there. Let's get some happiness from doing stuff there. Let's see, how many more archaeologists do I need to? Um... Two more? Well, no, like, well, two more for now, because there's other stuff around here as well, which we can go get later. But yeah, I definitely need to build up a military here. Uh, you know what? I would like a cargo ship. Yeah, they're going to declare war against me. It is only a matter of time. No. Man, do I need gold. <laughs> Scientist. Hmm. You know what, with the culture boost as well, I'm gonna go ahead and plop him down. Or her down. Okay, you here. You here. Brussels, excellent. Well, oh, friends, I don't really care about. Let's see, um, let's get a settler here. I need gold. So let's get the stock exchange going. Oh, well. Shoot. That will really increase my gold here, I think, right? Yeah, we're getting a lot of gold. It's actually only a 33 base. So we're getting... Wait, we're only getting... ...65 plus... Well, it's 33 plus 50, so... ...48... Okay, so trade routes don't count. So if I really want money, all I should be doing is going for a cargo ship. So let's do that. Cargo ship, and then just go for the Eiffel Tower, and then Broadway. But uh, I'm surprised you're not working more of these people. So I go great person focus. You grow very slowly. Getting lots of great people. Now we want we want you to keep on growing. I want you to get to like size 40. That would be nice. Okay, you're done with that. Go over here-ish next. Okay, you know what? I'm cutting the video off here, so thank you all very much for watching, and God bless.